Now, it's great to finally sit down and talk about a business venture. Absolutely, Ethan. I believe in building success on the foundation of strong ethical principles. Ethics isn't a set of rules. It's a mindset. And then the play. What bring you to the uh, gathering of four fools? Mark, it's great to finally sit down and talk about our business venture. Absolutely, Ethan. I believe in building success on the foundation of strong ethical principles. Ethics should be at the core of what we do. It's not just about profits. It's about creating a positive impact. I couldn't agree more. Our success should be a reflection of the values we uphold. Ethan, Mark, it's a pleasure to be a part of your venture. I've heard you're committed to ethical business practices. Missy, we believe in making a positive impact by achieving our business goals. Ethics isn't a set of rules, it's a mindset. It involves transparency, honesty, and commitment to societal well being. We want our business to be a force for good, not just a profit driven entity. Remember, ethical decisions might not be the easiest, but they are the ones that stand the test of time. As the conversation unfolds, the trio begins to weave the fabric of their business. In the quiet corridors of the office, ethical principles face a stern test. Ma, we have a problem. It appears that one of our suppliers engages in child labor. That's a serious if you can remember. It's a how did we find out? The office becomes a battleground of conflicting values where the pursuit of profit clashes with the responsibility to uphold ethical standards. I can't tell the supplier director with this. We need to confront the supplier and make it clear that we can't tolerate such practices. I am with you, Ethan. Our commitment to our practices should not waver. We need to talk about the materials you have been providing. It's clear that there have been shortcuts taken. I don't know what you're talking about. Our materials are up to standard. But the reason isn't up to standard and you know it. Our relationship relies on trust and you are jeopardizing it. Maybe there was an oversight, but I think it's not indicative of our overall practices. This affects not only our business, but also the trust of our clients. We want to tolerate unethical practices. You are blowing this out of proportion. It's just business. The confrontation intensifies, leaving Ethan to grapple with the difficult decision of whether to sever ties with the supplier. Let's build a business that not only thrives but builds a positive impact. Sustainability and fair trade should be at the core. Ethan, once a proponent of unethical practices, now champions a new direction under Marx and Emma's influence. We have the opportunity to set blue standards in an industry. Emma, what are your thoughts on integrating sustainability into our supply chain? We can source material responsibly, ensuring they meet ethical and environmental standards. And let's also explore partnerships with Fair Jewel. The trio dives into the details, weaving a narrative of business success, intertwined with ethical principles. Our success shouldn't come at the expense of the others. Let's not just meet the industry standards, let's exceed them. As they finalize the business plan, the boardroom becomes a space where innovation and ethics converge, setting the stage for a venture that balances prosperity with responsibility. Amidst the vibrant hum of the networking event, Ethan Sports Thomas, a rival entrepreneur, known for his cutthroat tactics, Thomas, long time no see. Ethan, always a pleasure. What bring you to the uh, gathering of four fools? As they exchange pleasantries, it becomes evident that Thomas is not one to shy away from unethical maneuvers. I have been exploring new opportunities. How about you? Always on the lookout for an edge. You know how it is. Ethan senses an undercurrent of deceit in Thomas' words. Success is meaningful only when built on the foundation of integrity. Don't you think? Thomas smirks 
revealing a stark contrast in their values as the networking event becomes a battleground for ethical principles. In a serene park, Mark and Ethan find themselves entangled in a heated debate. Mark, we can't afford to be idealistic. Thomas is gaining ground and if we don't adapt it, we will be left behind. I won't sacrifice our principles for short-term success, Ethan. That's not the way to sustainable success. Thanks. Compromising our ethics might lead to success. But at what cost? We have built our company on principles and that will take us apart. Her words hang in the air, forcing Mark and Ethan to reflect on the values that define their business. Sometimes we need to make tough decisions for the greater good. The greater good includes being true to who we are. We can find a way to compete without sacrificing our integrity. The debate continues, a pivotal moment that will shape the direction of their business. In a turn of events, Mark and Ethan convene in their office to discuss a significant shift in their business strategies. Ethan, I have been reflecting on MR's ethical strategies and I think that we should seriously consider adopting them. You want to change our entire approach. Really? Yes, transparency and responsible sourcing. It aligns with the values we want a company to embody. The office atmosphere shifts as they engage in a candid conversation. All right, let's explore this. But we need to make sure that it doesn't impact our bottom line. I am confident that ethical practices will empower our brand and attract more valuable customers. The decision to embrace Emma's ethical strategies marks a pivotal moment in their business journey. Ladies and gentlemen, today marks a milestone for us. We are proud to introduce a product that not only meets the high standards but also embodies. In a dazzling venue filled with eager attendees, Mark and Ethan unveil their innovation ethical product. This wouldn't be possible without the incredible team that shared our vision. Thank you for supporting a product that not only delivers performance but also upholds ethical win. I appreciate the transparency and ethical practices behind this product. It's a game changer. Marks and Ethan's approach proves that success and ethics can go hand in hand. The industry can learn a lot from their example. The launch is a resounding success, solidifying Mark and Ethan's reputation. Mark, have you heard the rumors circulating about us? It's damaging our reputation. I can't believe this. We have worked so hard to build trust in our business. Undiscovered to them, Thomas, fueled by envy or ulterior motives, continues to spread falsehoods. Thomas, what is the meaning of this? Why are you spreading lies about us? It's just the business season. I saw an opportunity and I took it. Thomas' betrayal leaves a lasting impact on both Ethan and Mark. We can't let this destroy us. We'll address this and prove the truth. As Ethan and Mark confront the aftermath of Thomas' deceit, they find themselves facing a new challenge, rebuilding the trust they have lost. Thank you all for being here today. We are aware of the rumors spreading about our businesses and we want to set the record straight. We have always been transparent and we are here to provide you the evidence of our ethical practices. The press conference becomes a platform for Mark and Ethan to demonstrate their dedication to transparency and integrity. Our commitment to ethical business has been unwavering. We understand the importance of trust in our business. We are not just here to address the rumors. We are here to rebuild the trusts. Moving forward, we will continue to prioritize ethical practices, ensuring that our business operates with utmost integrity. Ladies and gentlemen, tonight we recognize outstanding leaders who have shown exceptional commitment to ethical business practices. As Mark steps forward to accept his award, the room echoes with the validation of his choices. Mark, your journey is an inspiration to us all. Your success stands as a testament to the fact that integrity and achievement can go hand in hand. Now let's acknowledge Ethan, who has embraced a new path, one that prioritizes ethics and transparency. 
I have learned that success is meaningful only when built on a foundation of integrity. I am grateful for this recognition. The ceremony concludes with a shared understanding that success need not sum at the cost of one's values. Mark and Ethan's journeys converge, proving that ethical business practices can indeed lead to triumph.